every week we perform hundreds of different tasks in our laboratories. This work is performed at different workstations, using different instruments and materials, and employing different movements. As a result, each task makes a different set of demands on our bodies. If we aren't careful, some of them can lead to unhealthy stress or strain. The science of ergonomics helps us to take a look at these situations and determine what we need to do to avoid any harmful effects. It does this by examining our job, work area, instruments, and tools. Ergonomics shows us how to adapt what we do to our own physical makeup so we can work effectively and most importantly, safely. Are you short or tall? Do you have long legs? What about your arms? Physical size and shape are important considerations when designing work areas and equipment. To work safely, we need to minimize the amount of stress we place on our bodies. The design engineers who develop workstations and other lab equipment try to make them work well for everyone. Since this is pretty much impossible, they do their best to come close by designing them to fit most people. Customizing your work area so that it works best for you becomes a job for you and your supervisor. How closely you match up with your workplace will determine how hard your muscles and joints will be asked to work while you're on the job. To start, think about arranging your instruments and materials so you're not forced to make unhealthy movements such as overstretching. You also want to avoid long sessions of repetitive motion without rest, irregular and extreme positions, overly heavy loads, and using the wrong tool for the job. These are the main contributors to ergonomic health problems.